Well, 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 look who it is. It's you. It's you. 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 You're back here again. <laughs> Just kidding. Good day, Dino friends. Yeah, good day, Dino friends. Today, I'm back in the game Your Hospital. It's called Your Hospital. I know this. I called it the wrong name every single time. In the last video, I called it My Hospital because it's by the maker of my prison and I think I just kept saying it wrong. I think it's called Your Hospital because My Hospital is already taken. Anyway, that's not important. It's so rainy. Uh, today, I want to, I don't know, just expand the hospital a little bit better. I didn't really play at all since the last episode. So let's see. We have... Oh yeah, I made this. Sorry that it's been so long. I wasn't expecting the last video to do so well. So I'm glad people like this. I really want to play some more tycoons. I love tycoons so much. And this one's definitely going to be good because as I said, I've played the heck... Sorry for swearing. The heck out of my prison. It's such a good game. So I'm going to play this a lot as well. Uh, what I really want to do is design the hospital in Photoshop. That's what I did... That's what I did with my prison, basically in Photoshop, one pixel at a time, I decided where everything was going to go. Uh, and every pixel is like a square in the game. But before I can do that, I first have to unlock everything. Psych! Did you, did you just fall for one of my pranks? Did you just get epically lied to? You just got pranked, guys. Did I say... That I didn't play since the last episode. Well, I'm a big fat liar and I pranked you once again. I've been playing just like the money making part. I've just been getting like a bunch of um, patience just so that the money would come in. Just so I could unlock all the space. I've also unlocked all of the research. So now... I can get 80 patients delivered to me and they can have every disease, including skibidi. Uh, and the latest one is getting overheated. So I definitely want to get my hospital ready for that. But since I didn't actually change the building, we only have two beds. And if I click on deliver patients, I think it instantly delivers like 25 or something. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't have 25 beds. So, in this episode, let's quickly do that. Let's get the hospital ready for at least 20, or I don't know how, how many it's gonna deliver. Last time, I don't think it will do it right away, but last time I activated it, it delivered up to like 24 or 25 patients. It's crazy. Also, if you have not been keeping up to date with this game, you know, if my channel is the only one you've watched, uh, I would recommend also watching some other good ones. Some people are already at like episode 10 because, you know, they upload more consistently and I'm only at episode 2 but if you haven't watched anything else and you do like this game then let me tell you some things um, I found a code I don't know if it's still the only code because this was like two weeks ago um, I forgot where you put it but the code is release there it is release and if you redeem that code you get I think 750 money if you join oh hello visitor if you join the group, you get money every day. Um, I think it goes like this. 250 on your first day, 500 on your second day. And from that day onward, every day that you log in, I think you get $1,000. Because every time I log in now, I get $1,000 because I'm in a group. So I would advise that. Also, if you favorite the game and then you probably have to rejoin, you also get a star. Where is it? There we go. The favorite star. I'll put it there for now. It's not a great spot. It's not a great spot, but you get this star. I don't think you can do anything with it. I thought you might be able to like write on it, but I don't think you can. That's okay. It looks kind of cool. And um, since I have unlocked all the space, that means I know what the size is. And can you guess? Can you guess what the size is? It's exactly the same as in my prison. It's the same. <laughs> The size, okay, so the entire plot is 70, if you have the game pass for the extra space, to be fair. Um, 70 wide, 56 in depth. So I have done some drawing, but I'm not happy with it yet. I just did some sketching. Okay, so here at the bottom, we have the part that you cannot edit, right? So this is not part of the tycoon. This is just 
the road and stuff. So starting from here, I think the road should go to the right. And then here you would have like, this is where the ambulance would go. And then they could quickly go to like, I don't know, maybe this could be like an emergency surgery and stuff. Like, let's say if someone's really in danger, then they could, the ambulance would go here. The person would go out of the ambulance into this room and get treatment right away. So they don't have to go up any stairs or anything or elevators. I think that's the best. Um, here's the here's going to be the normal entrance and then here's going to be the parking lot for visitors and stuff uh, At least that's my first sketch. I'm not super happy with it yet Basically what this is I know it doesn't all make sense, but like these colored ones are like the different treatment rooms uh, Brown is supposed to be stairs. This makes sense to me because I remembered it. I memorized it, right? Uh, these orange ones were rooms each fit for patients like those You know when people are in hospital in one of those rooms that has like four people in it four beds in it that's what these orange ones are but yeah basically what this is is just me trying to fit everything that you p could possibly need in one drawing and it's kind of like forced so i don't love the layout but it's 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 all right it's all right so that's how far i am right now but i'm not going to build all of that today maybe instead i'll also just let it evolve okay yeah up, up where we are indeed we are indeed up to 23 people who all have an emergency. You can't all have an emergency. Everyone has an emergency. 23 people. Okay, every patient needs a bed. Well, we have 23 people. How am I going to very quickly add uh, 21 beds? Okay, first I'm going to put a hallway. I think this is a nice spot. I'll put a hallway and then it'll go into, I don't know, maybe like a room for now. This is temporary. Uh, just a, I'll just put a big hall, one of those that you had like in the early 20th century, you know, those old wards, is that what it's called? Like a big hall that has like a hundred beds in it, <laughs> where everyone who was ill was like in, in the same room, in like a giant room. I, I'll just quickly build something like that for now, because I have to help all these people, they're all sick. Uh, what floor do we want? Um, can I use snow? Does it look that much on? Because, yeah, it looks kind of... It doesn't super look like snow. It just looks like a nice white floor, doesn't it? I might actually use that. Guys, can we pretend that it's not floor... That's not snow, please? By the way, it cost me about three and a half million. Just to prank you guys. Just to pretend like I didn't have any money. And like I didn't play since the last episode. So who really got pranked? I think it was me. I think I, I'm the one who got pranked. I'm the one who got pranked because now I don't have any money after spending three and a half million. <laughs> it was worth it, okay? Because I pranked you guys. As long as I prank. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Okay, the floor here. I messed it up. Hang on. Okay, I think I like the white floor. I feel like hospitals often have a white floor. Um, oh, this is glass roof. Ah, I'm making the floor out of glass. That's not what I meant to do. Wait, where's the snow? Oh, here, here. Grass and then click side. There we go. Also, that glass kind of looks like water. I think I can make uh, like a nice pond out of that or something. Hmm. Oh, this is just nine. This is just nine beds. This is nowhere near enough. <laughs> oh, no. I'm in trouble. Um, how am I going to... Am I just going to make this super long? That would look so bad. Just like one super long hallway. Ah, uh, but I just don't have enough room... Or not enough beds for all these people. Well, they don't all have to sleep at the same time. Maybe this is enough. Oh, I don't have light or decorations. I'm going to add some more stuff. Oh. These things take up two slots. I thought kind of like a wall, you could put them in between, like here in between. Oh, they take up space? Okay, um, maybe I'll just use a wall then or something, I don't know. Like this? If I do it, a wall all the way to the ceiling, it's too extreme. It's too extreme. I guess I'll do it like this. But they don't really have privacy now. <laughs> they don't really have privacy now. Well, they don't have light either, so let's... Uh, Let's get our priorities straight first. And then that was light. Okay, that was, that was dumb. Okay, um. 
somehow I'm not getting as many complaints about beds, even though I only added nine beds. Um, there's no actual decorations here or anything, but yeah, I'm getting mostly complaints now that they don't have the treatment. So, to prank you guys, I already unlocked everything, right? So that means that now I actually don't have enough money to get all the different treatments. But I guess I'll just make some rooms for that as well. By the way, let me know in the comments how you feel about the snow floor. I think it looks kind of nice. Maybe not for here. Maybe more for like a surgery room. Like a room where the actual treatment is. That has to be like super clean. Because it does look like a very clean white floor. If you don't think of it as snow. But maybe for here we can do something else. Or, okay, I have another idea. We could also go like this and put like the typical like checkered floor i don't know i don't know how i feel about that how a checkered but in a different color like checkered gray that's not bad right checkered gray oh i wish i could just select uh let, let's say like these rooms and move them all back a little bit so that i could expand the middle but right now i guess if i want to do that i would have to like rebuild these rooms over here and then i can expand the middle i guess it's not ideal <laughs> it's not ideal but yeah it makes sense that you cannot like move entire rooms that would be kind of weird i guess okay moving everything around a little bit <laughs> everything's still the same just slightly different spot <laughs> I, I just really need this entrance to be bigger. I, I, I actually want a two-story high entrance. So you come in and you have like this big hall. Because that's how a hospital in my city has it. And I kind of like that. So it's like you get in. I think that's how a lot of hospitals have it. Hang on. How much space in between these? Four. One, two, three, four. Oh, then the light would have to be here. It's a bit far though. Oh, I didn't put a ceiling yet. Hang on. Okay, I moved one of the benches over here. I guess I can put one over here on the wall as well. Um, okay, how am I going to transform it from what it is now into something better? Like, I kind of like the idea of slowly transforming it one room at a time. But I also like just like flattening everything making a full plan for an end goal and just starting to work on that that's how i did it with my prison and it worked really well but at the same time i really also like the idea of just seeing where where it goes maybe i'll do that first just see where it goes if i just sl slowly try to add one room at a time i think it will just mutate into something ugly because out of necessity i'll just sort of put rooms everywhere it won't make any sense but maybe it will become something beautiful. And if not, we can always flatten it then. Of course, when there's no one inside. And then build the thing that I drew in Photoshop. Okay, so let's see what treatment we have. We Okay, we already had this one. The one that heals the noob disease. And this one and heals the, I don't know, the depression. I don't know, the, the therapist goes here. Psychoanalysis. Okay, so then I guess we'll start with the cheapest one because obviously I cannot afford right now the last two. Uh, for now, okay. Um, I'll just put them. <laughs> okay, hang on. Let me put them on the lawn temporarily. This temporary. <laughs> just put them on the lawn. Don't worry about it. Listen, I'm making a room for you. Okay, don't worry about it. I'm just seeing what I can afford. Okay, I can afford. Oh, this one is giant, by the way. Tomator. I'll put the toilet machine first. Okay, there we go. Four of them I can afford. Then I need still the Tomator, Humanifier, and a Cryotube. Um, it's starting to look nice already, I think. Nicer. A, a bit more spacious. That's really what I need. And I think there is plenty of room to make space. Because as I said... Well, did I say this? Basically, in this... This one isn't even finished. Like, I didn't use this space. I didn't use this space. I didn't use a lot of space here and here. And this is just the ground floor. And it already has almost everything except for all the beds. So, unless if the uh, second or first floor, whatever you want to call it, is going to have just like a billion beds in it, uh, I probably would just put them like in 
uh, near the walls so they people can look outside. That's just the nicest, I think. I mean, a hospital room. I feel like a hospital room for a patient needs to have a window. So in the middle, you would have the treatment rooms. But yeah, I didn't really do anything yet for the second or first floor. Uh, I'm just going to call it first floor because that's what we call it here in the Netherlands. Um, sorry if you're from like the United States and you call it second floor. But yeah, ground floor, then one above that, I'm calling it first floor. Um, I didn't draw anything yet. Basically, it only has uh, indicators of where the elevators and stairs go. And I made this thing. That's like a ceiling that goes over the road here. Like you come in here and you go left or right. Put a little like roof over that. And maybe on top of that, there could be some words that say, I don't know, hospital. Oh, I don't have a name yet. I just... <gasps> Guys. Okay, you know what? Leave a comment. Leave a comment. Oh, yep. Yeah. Close this. Leave a comment on what I should name my hospital. I don't want to be Buildosaurus's Hospital 1. Give me like a good name. Preferably Dino themed. Dino healing. Nah, that's terrible. That's terrible. Okay, let me know some, uh, some good names. Okay, this is not very good, but I'm just very quickly just adding some rooms. Oh, I'm running out of money for walls! No! Dang it. All right. I guess I'm going to have to end the episode here and see you next time for when I have some more money. But I was just going to quickly add some rooms. Just like one for each type of treatment yeah, that I have so far. The toilet one, of course. We have to treat people with the brain rot. Um, there we go. One of the rooms is slightly wider. It's for a different machine that I don't have yet. Um, yeah, they were, these were supposed to be rooms, but I forgot. I didn't see that I was running out of money. Um, and then, of course, they have doors leading up to, the, up to them. Can I afford doors, please? <laughs> I don't know if I can afford doors right now, guys. <laughs> okay, well, this is where the treatment is. <laughs> Okay, so you go over here, then you have a hallway, and then you have to just get into the right. Yeah, this is very claustrophobic. I don't like this at all. Um, let me know in the comments how you are building your hospital if you're doing, if you're playing this game, or if you play other, any type of building games. Do you prefer to like plan it all out from the beginning or just see where it goes? Like, I like to see where things go. But usually it turns out better when I plan a little bit more. Like right now, this was without planning and it's absolutely chaotic. Like it doesn't turn out like super ugly. But like, it's not exactly what I want, I think. Let me know how you usually do it. But yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and get some more money. So by the next episode, maybe I'll have like a few hundred K. So we won't out run out of money. Uh, also, let me know our name for my hospital. Funniest answer, best answer wins, I guess. I'll just pick a random one. Well, not random. I'll pick my favorite from the comments. Um, yeah, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, thank you for the support on the last one. Tell me how much you like this, if you like this game. Um, that's the end. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to stomp. Oh, wait, wait. Thank you to Green Thunder and Carl for sponsoring this video. Um, if you also want to be a patron and get a shout out in every video, make sure to check the description for all the info you need. And if you can't give any money, that's okay. You can still like, subscribe and do all of those things. So thank you so much. Um, yeah, don't forget to stomp. Don't forget to stomp. Like it answer. Stomp, 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 stomp.